Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Andrew Lindley with the Supreme DJs. Uh, we got a quick, cool little collaboration going on. I was asked from Melissa from Beauty and Babes to just come share a little bit of knowledge about how to make planning your wedding a little less stressful. So this is my take on it. Um, I would say this is a big point where your entertainment should come in handy because they should be, they're the ones who are kind of controlling the flow of the event. And they should be the ones who are taking care of everything on that end. That's just what I think anyways. It's what I do. Uh, it's something we are very proud of that we can we can handle the timeline. We'll do everything for you guys so you guys can really just relax and uh, enjoy your day because that's what it's about and that's what you guys should have. So I have a little presentation here. Um, it's just five tips for planning the perfect party. This, they're just five little quick tips that should help make the event so fun and exactly like what you guys want it to do. So number one is get on the dance floor. <laughs> so your guests are gonna be where you are. This is just a, the fact, it doesn't matter what's going on. If you guys are out, I don't know if you smoke, I'd probably recommend just getting the patch <laughs> because this will happen. Or if you just hang out at the bar all night, you guys are the center of attention and your guests are going to come flock to you no matter what. So if, if you want this party to be a dance floor all night, everyone's partying, having an awesome time, you guys have to be on the dance floor. There's no way around that. It's just how it's going to be. Uh, number two, as I said, you need to relax as much as possible. You guys don't need to micromanage the timeline. It should all be on paper. We should already, Everybody should already be on on point on this we should all know what's going on you guys don't need to worry about that you're professionals we are professionals and we should be able to handle that um just for being part of this series if you reach out to melissa or reach out to me i have a ton of free content that i will give you guys just for creating the flow and making the like your timeline creating that um, if it wasn't provided for you, we'll just give it to you for free. It's $200 free value just for you guys for being here. It's awesome. But basically, yeah, you guys just got to relax. Your event pros know what's going on. We know the order of events should be simple, and I hope it is. Uh, number three, my favorite one, be strategic with seating arrangements. And what we mean by this is please Please, please, I don't know why this happens, but it happens every single time. Try not to sit older guests too close to the speakers. Um, and this will go hand in hand with the next slide. But basically, I know spacing is always an issue. You gotta fit so many people in the building, but there is some rules here. You don't wanna fit um, people who are gonna complain that the, the speakers are too loud or that the sound is blaring in your ears. You don't wanna sit them too close right in front of the speakers or that's what's going to happen and then we we have to oblige them we got to turn it down and then everybody's going to suffer um i'll get a little more deeper into this on the next slide but yeah you, the the sound has got to be loud it's got to be able to fill the room and if they're going to complain about turning it down we're going to have to and that's just how it's going to be uh number four put your dj in a good spot um Try not to put us in the corners. If it's not right in front of old people, it's gonna be right in the corner, the back corner, so no one can see us or hear us anyways. You gotta be able to engage with the DJ. You wanna have people feel comfortable with them. Um, what I recommend is at the front or back of the dance floor, so kinda we can set our speakers up to hit both, both sides. So everyone, there's good coverage on the music, everyone's hearing it. Um, but yeah, you just wanna you want you want to make sure everyone's comfortable with the DJ, kind of interact with them, and it'll just it'll make for a better party. I promise you that. And number five, the photo booth position. Do not put it in another room. That also happens all the time. I don't know why, but uh, you want to keep it kind of close to the dance floor, close to the action, so that whenever people got to run off and take photos, they're not leaving the room, they're not losing all their energy. It's just, it's just a, a tip that I would really recommend. You, you always want to keep people together, 
more condensed once it is that time because you want everyone to be together partying together you don't want everyone off on their own doing their own things um but yeah we love to work with you i'm andrew lindley with the supreme djs this is put together with melissa from beauty and babes an awesome little collabo here just creating stressful free weddings fun exciting uh if you need a free quote feel free to give us a shout but also we got those free gifts for you we've got the music planning cheat sheets um a lot of spotify playlists just to make selecting your music a breeze and then if you check out our site we got a lot of free quizzes which should help out too but yeah give us a shout take care